What it do, flight crew? FTC. Flight team stand up! Mr. Beast! One dollar versus a hundred million billion dollar car. Behind me are the most expensive cars in the world. No joke, we Ooh. got our hands on over. Behind me are the most. Mr. Beast is giving us a shout out, guys. Mama, we done made it again. I see you, Mr. Beast. He's only winning that for one reason. You know, there's millions and millions and millions and millions and millions of shirts out there, fellas. And you chose that one, bro. He's giving us a shout out subliminally. Mr. Beast, W. Expensive cars in the world. No joke. We got our hands on over $250 million worth of cars. Damn. One of them even costing us. I love cars. I'm a huge car geek. And we're going to be exploding, sailing, driving, and even flying all of these cars to show you Whoa, what they have flying cars? I ain't going to lie. That's one thing I'm, I'm good off doing. I don't care how trendy it ever gets. Hopefully it doesn't. But I'm never, bro, flying? What? And how do you don't like prevent, like, man. Expensive. Starting with this $1 That's car. Crazy. Literally a rust bucket. Why are you selling this car for a dollar? Well, you see, it's pretty much worthless. <laughs> and I can't put any time or money in this thing. If you grab hey. this dollar, the deal is final. Hey, take now, it or leave it. This is a piece of garbage. But when you spend 20K on repairs, it actually runs. All right, let's get this bad boy. No way it's going to run right. I did not think he would start. How is this thing driving? He said he spent 20 bands. What are they doing? Alright, well, that was the one. Wait, how did they do that? I thought I wasn't a man. We made a webcam, yo. Yo. Best editor on YouTube. Best editor on you know me. In the hundred thousand dollar <coughs> car, which drives itself, no joke. No one is currently in this oh, car yeah, and it is moving. Let's see what a hundred grand gets you. There's a lot of room in this car. This is one of the few cars that can actually fit all my kids. Do you have kids? Yeah, all of them. Let's take it for a little spin. The real reason you're buying a Tesla is because it can drive itself. All right, I'm no longer driving the car. Oh, it's switching lanes. Whoa! It is literally driving itself. My feet are not touching the gas, and I'm not touching the steering. Bro, I don't are you trust that. Me now you can take a nap while driving. No, don't do that. Oh, okay. Now let's see how fast Yo, the car. Yo, taking a nap while driving is crazy. It jerks you backwards. I thought That's that was just for commercials. Just I didn't know you could do that. Car that literally transforms Bro. into an airplane and flies. But now. Yo, they got a GTA car that transforms oh, and flies. <laughs> Lambo. Oh, keys in here? How'd nobody steal it? And even though this costs twice as much, it has half as much space. I don't know if I'd pay 200k for this car because I don't fit in it. Do they even know how to drive a Lamborghini? Small. I would do Ford. I think you just click the shifter. All right. And now we're on the road. Oh, that sound. Oh my gosh, she sounds angry. Dang, she's got some power. Oh my gosh, this car is insane. I'm barely touching the gas and we're flying. This might be the fastest car I've ever driven. If you need to compensate for something, this is definitely the car. And now we are at the $300,000 car. And this is supposedly the safest car on the planet. It's like a tank. Is this a military Yo, they never released that. that. So high up. You were also just in the Lamborghini to the tank. Didn't they say going to release that Let's Tesla truck? What makes this car so safe? First things first is the bulletproof windows that are this thick. The car is Bro, also they got a GTA in car, exclusive literally. proof armor. Now we're gonna put to the test later on. Don't oh, do that in you the car. Press the buttons. Oh, so bad. You want to hit the smoke screen button, please? Whoa! Whoa! That is crazy. We have a literal smoke screen. Oh my Whoa. gosh! It smells. But the best part is, none of these features are what make the car really safe. It's the literal explosive proof frame around the car. And we're going to be the first people to test it. And for reference, before we blow up the $300,000 car, we're going to blow up a normal car to see if the passengers survive. Three, two, one. Oh, it's the dummies. Damn. How do you know it's explosive? It but the mannequins literally flew out of the car. It flew a sunroof into that thing. It doesn't handle it well at all. And before we blow up this car, I'm gonna put feastables inside of it. Better protect feastables. Our so supposedly this car is explosion proof, but that's never been tested. Let's see if the mannequins and even more importantly the feastables survive. Three, two, one. Let's see if it was a scam or not. The car actually 
actually survived the blast with only a few minor scrapes. It put a tent in the window. Well, for 300k, is that legal? Like to drive on the road, bro? That is like literally amazing. The car actually survived the blast with only a few That's minor not bad. Scrapes. It put a tent in the I window. I thought this would be like a million. This is only 300k. Ooh, bro, I, is, is this available right now? Yo! Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where are the Feastables? Chandler, get out the way. <laughs> the Feastables survived! If you're looking for a car that can take a bomb, I officially recommend this one. But since we're not Damn. going to war anytime soon, for only an extra $200,000, you can get this $500,000 boat car. On land, this oh, is Oh, yo, they got these real GTA <laughs> cars. Just drive it in the water, and it turns into a boat. We're gonna let Carl go no first. Way. How oh, fast is it going to water? I don't understand the water like horsepower, sure so like, I'm lost with that part. No, we're when it fine. comes to water. Oh, it looks like it worked. Let's see what happens. Oh my god, we're going we're driving in the water. Oh, holy So you press this until you hear a beep? That's a beep. Now I should be able to drive this like a normal car, but on the water. Damn, wow. hold on. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, this is incredible! Woo! This was literally a car five seconds ago. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't be out there with him, but I get car sick. No oh, we're getting there. Oh, oh. Bro. <laughs> oh. Bro. 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 Oh, my God. No, that is too oh, lit. Yo. All right, now. Let's get the right or left. Oh, they're they hitting donuts. Loki like slick as Joe's done. Yo! We always knew Joe would come to me. Bro! That was crazy. I just met this guy five seconds ago. We're gonna race. Yo, what's up with the word five seconds ago? Is that a new word now? He's just so much faster. He's not even trying. Come on! Faster! Oh, we're destroying him! Oh, this is not true! I can't believe we just made him! This thing goes way too fast. I can't think of a better way to celebrate a win than a Feastables bar. Hey, oh, that's a I wanna, yo, that was my oh, favorite hey, flavor. Hey, hey, hey. I got it. Feastables is the number one chocolate on the planet. If you're not eating it, you should fix that. The fact that all three of us are driving cars on the ocean is insane. Jimmy, I love this thing so much. And the craziest Man. part is, this is just the beginning of this video. The next car on our list can literally fly. And since I'm afraid of heights, I let Carl and Nolan take Oh, this no, one. I'm good. I'm good. I'm not going to that thing. No, 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 no. It also has wings that can take it literally 8,000 feet in the sky. There's literally a propeller on that car. Stay here and watch it take off. I'm going to go in that plane and follow it. I just don't believe that this is actually going to fly. Nah, bro. I don't trust that, dog. It's taking off. The wheels aren't on the ground anymore. It's literally a car that's flying. These cars are getting crazier and crazier. I can't I'm even believe good. it. There's a car a mile above my head. Does it right even now. come with a parachute? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. For 600k, they need to design more stuff onto it, bro. Dog. Like I feel like if you sneeze, bro, you don't be bro. I feel like for six hundred thousand dollars, this is a steal. Nah, no, yeah. No, how much are they paying you? Oh, that's wrong for that. Car, they wrong. didn't only bring one of them. As you can imagine, there are a lot of one million dollar cars out there. So to make sure I bought your favorite, we got the ten coolest one million dollar cars. Ooh, and as per usual, yeah, the we GTA have the entire for racetrack to ourselves. Ooh. So I let my friends choose whatever car oh. they wanted. I'm gonna try the you pick. Look at this beep. Am I gonna fit in this? Which one are y'all picking? Text and drive. It's private property. It's technically you got that Rari. <laughs> oh, here we go. All right, they better make sure they drive safe. Please drive safe, y'all. I feel like I'm in NASCAR. I'm having so much oh. fun. This feels like Fast and Furious. There's just something so masculine about driving overpriced, loud cars. On a private racetrack. On a private racetrack. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta send a text. 
Bro, they had me right there. I was like, hold on, hold up. Look at how loud was that? This $2 million limited edition hydrogen car. No joke, this car is completely powered by hydrogen. And Holy. And it drinkable water. Wait, what's hydrogen? Exhaust. But the car is still being developed. So this is just a prototype. I don't think I've ever struggled this much to get in a car. Bro, for $2 million, at least make it more comfortable. Damn. All right, let's see how she closes. That's crazy. No, that, I ain't gonna lie. Those to seats. Get in a car. Don't look it at all, bro. Look like straight cardboard you're sitting back on, bro. Y'all could have put like more better cushions, bro. This right, cross going for 10, 15k. They have better comfort than that. That's crazy. That is such a ripoff. What's the horsepower on this? We're about to turn on the road. This is a bro. This is a straight up GTA. Bro, GTA car. This is like what is that? Ten million uh, shark points or whatever they call it. Never been driven on a road before. Oh, you should have told me before I got in. They built this car as a proof of concept, so driving it on the road is questionable. Ah, proof of concept. That person over there is literally filming our car. That's crazy. That'd be somebody's wife right there. And what's special about this phone is it literally folds in half. Boom, half the size. Also, I'd wear a seatbelt, but it doesn't have one. They haven't gotten that far yet. <laughs> the folding screen on the Flip 5 makes the phone fit in your pocket better. It also allows you to use two apps at the same time. Show, let me show you. On the bottom half of the phone, I have Google, and on the top half, we're watching a Bro, there are many videos. phones now. Oh, yeah, yeah, man. They're, these guys oh, are amazing, dog. Mr. Beast Squad is next level. Gas, it still has a range of over 8,000 miles and a top speed of 221 miles per hour. And another cool thing about this phone is it can record in 4K 60 FPS. You can even record while it's folded. In fact, the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra is the official vlog camera of the channel. Y'all copy the new Samsung Galaxy Ultra over the iPhone? Engine. What? That's such a cool sound. It literally has a front-facing camera even when you close it down. The Flip 5 is the most innovative phone Samsung has ever made. Click the link in the description to cop one right now. Do it. Wow. A lot of cars are on me and everyone. Samsung, Mr. Beast sponsors. Make sure. We'll see you at the next car. Back at the racetrack, we have the most exotic and powerful car yet. Costing $10 million, this Koenigsegg Vader is the only one in existence. So this is the world's fastest production car? Oh my god. And with literal Ooh. crushed diamonds in the paint, the insurance companies would only let the owner drive it. That's probably the coolest door I've ever seen in my life. You're crazy. Close right, the school. So what was that for? I made a man cry. Really? Yeah, I scared the crap out of him. <laughs> I'm gonna put my head back so I don't get whiplash. <laughs> How is it so fast? <laughs> the reason this car is one of the fastest on the planet is because of its twin turbocharged V8 engine. And the wow. fact that its entire frame is made out of air core carbon fiber, making it weigh 500 pounds less than a Lamborghini. I've never witnessed anything like this before. Damn. Damn. Like riding in a roller coaster. My heart is pounding. That's crazy. <laughs> well, that was awesome. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Let's go hang out with Jay Leno and see what a twenty million dollar car looks like. All right. Jay Leno was the king of the Tonight Show for over twenty years. Oh, and I remember in the early two thousands. I seen like maybe a couple of clips and stuff in the world, including this twenty million dollar McLaren F one. Did, did it just start doing that because of you? Twenty million dollars. <laughs> Robbers, don't try that. And what makes it so valuable? <coughs> it's a V12 carbon fiber. It's extremely light, and it was 241 miles an hour, which is still the fastest for a non-turbocharged, non-supercharged car. I'll show you something kind of cool. You got three seats, as you can see. Wow. The car wow. is about 2,300 pounds. Your most modern cars are 4,000. It's more comparable to Nolan's mom than another car. That's right. Exactly. In fact, Nolan's mom was really the one they used as the benchmark. <laughs> You guys want to go for a ride? Uh, of course. There's no way getting in that. Damn, building, bro, that thing looks small. Wow. It's oddly comfortable to have three seats. Like yeah, like why haven't more cars been invented like that? Wait, you don't have that a four seat. There needs to be three seat love too. Okay. Yo, they need to show love to their three seat. That that's kind of cool. I like this right here. You have little two seats right there. That's kind of like I don't know. In a way, it's kind of like playing a little bit. I don't know. What y'all think? 
That's kind of cool. That's cool. I've never seen. That's why. Why is this my first time seeing a three seater? Well, I mean, the closest thing that I've seen to like a three seater is like, you know, those like SUV trucks. But like sometimes like the uh, the trunk is like missing. Like we've seen them on like road rages and stuff like that. Um, I've seen people like say three to them, you know, before. And like I rode where, you know, what I'm saying like back in the day, like whether if it was like getting a ride from like my homeboy or something. Um, you know, um, they had a you know a car similar like that where it was like three seater and like a truck, but it was a made to be a three seater. But this is like made to be a three. This is fire as hell. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This, this is, is nice. Where the wheel is in. Or if you were in England, this it's is like the wheels smooth. in the middle. It, it's, it looks confusing, but it's kind of smooth. But then again, like nah, because like imagine you go into like a Uber or whatever, and like. <laughs> The, it, 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 you're this close to the Uber driver, cause like I, bro, I always make sure you know I sit in the back if I have to take an Uber or whatever. Like that just make things a little bit. Awkward. What, what you guys think? That's right. Bro. That's too close. Right. If it's like an Uber driver, I wouldn't want a three seat. But personal car? Born? Hell yeah. Actually, I got this in '98. I popped out of my mom, and he's like, you know what? Let's celebrate by buying this That's car. Right. Here's the second part. I'm your dad. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Interesting. How much did you buy this for? I paid eight hundred. That was awkward. I ain't gonna lie. To you. What was that? You'll never get your money back. But then it just went up and up and up and up, and now they're twenty million dollars. You know, so it's it's crazy. Damn. So basically, made you a million dollars a year every year you've owned it. I guess that's fair to say. Yeah. Carl, what do you think of the car? I like it. What's stopping you from buying one? Um. Nineteen point nine million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever had a rap? Oh, yeah. Low key flesh, he said he's still a millionaire, but I can't do it. Thank you so much for taking us out. No problem, guys. That was perfect. These next two cars are so expensive that they are literally locked away in the museum at all times. Combined, really? they cost eighty million dollars, and somehow we convinced the museum to give us the cars. How? And this is where the video gets literally mind blowing. Crank this bad boy up. Let's hear the 50 miller. Not gonna lie, I like the 50 million dollar one a little better. So I jumped in the 50 million dollar car with Dona Media, and Chandler got in the 30 million dollar car with Bobak. 30 the million? 50 million? How? Are you ready? I'm How ready. fast these cars going? This. The reason the what car that Chandler do? is in is so expensive is because it was specifically constructed as a gift from the founder of Ferrari to the founder of Ford. This is the only version of this Ferrari ever made in human history. Oh, oh uh, okay, I see why. See, that would be the only reason. One on one car. Like, cause yeah, that's something. Like, no scrapage. You don't really notice how like crappy the street is until you drive something that's fifteen million. Wait, that police escort. The car we're in is the most expensive oh, that's probably because of museum in well. existence. It was the legendary actor Steve McQueen's daily driver, and he got so many speeding tickets driving it that his license was actually suspended. I'm noticing every single pothole now, and because these cars are so expensive, we just... have an entire police escort dedicated to making sure nobody comes close to the car. That's crazy, dog. Hey, get some speed. Uh, that is a flex. Bro, I'm, yo, you get it. Uh, the car comes with an instant escort, bro. What if they start making cars like that? That's crazy as hell. You lost your hat, man. And while we were all having fun, Bo Bachman pushed the $30 million car to its absolute limit. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Hold on, the car stopped. Hold on one second. We hit a tooth too hard. <laughs> the $30 million oh. car stalled. We're going to hop out of these things before we break them. Let's go drive the $100 million world's first Ferrari. Most people would imagine. Bro, 100 nah, dog. If somebody's lying or something. Somebody, something's getting ripped off, bro. Whatever the car that was 30 or 50 million, if it just stopped, I understand it's old and everything like that. And I know about engines and all that stuff. But, bro, that's just crazy. The engine got to be worth it. Inter bro, that engine better be worth it until that damn band they try to give me in 2K with that 4,007. Bro, that thing need to be worth it until, like, 7,015.25, bro. Like, that engine needs... And, and, and it has to come with the warranty, too. Like, that's just crazy as hell. And I wonder what the maintenance would even, like, be like for a situation like that. Like, how do you even fix it? Like, is the car even going to work anymore? $100 million world's first... Ferrari. Most World's first Ferrari. See, that's why it's under me. A $100 million dollar car would look something like this. But you'd be surprised to find out that this is the $100 million dollar car. 
This car is so historic and valuable that this museum representative is the only person on earth allowed to drive it. It's only really? allowed to be driven on this bridge. We had cops completely close the roads, and we even had street cleaners fill in every pothole and clean the entire street to ensure that nothing damages this one hundred million dollar car. This is Damn! crazy. All right, and now we're on the bridge. Oh my god. A hundred million dollar car right there, guys. hundred million dollars barreling down the street. Oh, I keep Another hat. hat. He lost his hat. <laughs> That's the second time. Most expensive car comes with a free hat. Come on. Come on. This is awesome. They have one thing more fun than this. All right. For it. Let's go. Bro, a hundred million dollars? And he said it's the first Ferrari made. Cause that is a flex. What the heck? Hey man, shout out Mr. Beast! Another bang in the book, man. What's your favorite car? And do you think it was worth it?